Warning, this video contains mature content including, but not limited to, swearing and random acts of violence. If you can't handle that, get the fuck off my channel. Hello everybody, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel is God's Plane once again. And today I am going to be playing Brawlhalla. I have just downloaded it after a recommendation from Sam Strippen on uh, one of the co-optional podcasts. Figured I'd try it out. I've already set up uh, the controls and stuff like that. You can play keyboard or uh, keyboard and mouse or an Xbox 360 controller, which is what I'm going to be using. Not a whole lot to the options menu. Uh, as you can see here, music, sound, full screen, whatever. There's friends list and little missions, so I might as well just play as one of these guys just for the heck of it. See who Sir Roland is when we get into the game, if we can. Uh, there's lore for each character, which is pretty cool. And they're constantly updating. There's a competitive scene ranked. Uh, today I am going to play just a single player game just to get the swing of things and then I will be playing I will try maybe an online game just we'll see how long the match times are from what I've heard from this game is much like Super Smash Brothers in some ways but created by an indie dev team so it sounds interesting to me I figured I'd try it out and plus there's nothing decent on <laughs> on uh, PC anyways that's kind of like that so let's see who we have we have Cassidy oh everybody's called legends all the characters are uh, Nash who I unlocked through a loot crate and I got white fang I got his legendary skin a spear skin hammer skin all that stuff but it looks like from what I can tell I don't get that until later I'm not really sure so I guess I can move my mouse out of the way, start using controller, so I can use it. Yeah, so I get White Fang Nash, Howlin' Skull, Longtooth, Hunting Spear. That's cool. Um, there's different emotes and colors for each stuff, so that's cool. Let's see, we had... This chick looks cool, I think I'll probably end up playing her quite a bit. And just I just like bows. It's just kind of my my jam. I'm guessing this is random. Yeah. So let's see. The missions were Taros and Roland. You'll try. Oh, and at the bottom you can see the. If I move my mouse over here, you can see the weapon. I'm guessing that's how speed, strength, how fast they run, and their defense. I'm guessing. So we'll see how that plays into it. See if I'm right, then Roland is more of a tanky character. While this guy is a little bit slower, but runs faster and is really strong. So we'll try this guy out. Get different colors here. I wish there was a red one. That's unfortunate. I'll just go with the classic brown. I don't have anything for him. So we'll just go with that guy. Uh, let's see. And I guess we're just going against bots, medium bots. Yeah, sure, fine. Uh, let's see, manage party. Select, you can change the bot difficulty. We'll just leave him at medium. Four bots is fine. And I guess we'll just go. Let's see, can I change timed mode? Teams off lives. Let's do a quick, let's say five minute match. Let's say that. Um, gadgets, sure, why not? Um, let's see, we have time mode, stock mode, brawl mode. Brawl ball, that sounds interesting. We'll have to try that. Bomb skip ball. So let's go classic time mode, just, just for shits and giggles. Lots of cool maps here. Let's go random. All right, so we're playing against Cassidy, Queen Nye, and Lord Vrax. All right, 
Let's see how it goes. Three, two, one, brawl. So you got light attacks, heavy attacks, jumping, weapons. Oh, you get my bucket. Oop. It's like you can jump pretty high. Looks like, and there's a double, triple jump, huh? Got the hammer. Oh, nice. You can throw them. Let's see what this does. All right, there's my axe. So, getting a weapon seems to be kind of important here. Oh, and you can wall jump. Cool. It's something I always liked about certain characters. And shoot. certain characters in Smash Brothers was the being able to wall jump. So it looks like there's a long range weapon and then a short range weapon for each character. Ooh, nice. So. And there's also seems to be very. Ooh, similar to Smash Brothers, where you have different attacks based on which way you attack. Ooh, that sucked. I wasn't paying attention to my damage. The guy who brought you in, or brought me in right there, was a companion, kind of. You can see him floating in the background. They're uh, unlockable through their like, DLC or whatever. So you can... I like that you can run up there and like grab my axe after I drop it or whatever. See what that does. Oh, that's cool. Snap. Oh. All right. Had enough. You guys. Oh no. All right. Oh, so our health is in the top left. You can see the uh, the damage that everybody has. Mine's getting red, so yeah. <laughs> so I'm really easy to kill. So instead of like a percentage, it goes off of different colors. Looks like white, torn, yellow, orange, and red. Oh, get off. Get off. Alright. I haven't figured out how, let's see, dodge it works yet much. That was like a big part of Smash Brothers was being able to dodge and stuff like that. Oh, and you can catch you can catch your weapons in midair, which is cool. Oh. Oh, stay up. Throwing weapons doesn't have as much of an effect as in Smash Brothers, it seems. But bombs do. Doesn't look like there's a whole lot of edge guarding or anything like that. Cause it doesn't seem like you can jump onto the edges. Ooh, that hit him hard. Not competitive, but uh, online. Some sort of multiplayer is. I can see if I can get a match after this. I'm really interested in the like ball modes or whatever, whatever that was called. Berserk! The like the fact that the weapons are almost mandatory for this. For this game, or it's really interesting. Five, four, three, two, one. 
All right, that was fun. Let's see, 13 KOs, 14, four falls, zero accidents. I'm guessing accidents where you just fall off by yourself. So those are just computers, not too bad. So we will go back. We'll try. Let's see, just an online game. Let's see, win one or play two match games with Taros or Sir Roland. So we tried Taros last game. We'll try Sir Roland this game. I think I'm gonna go with blue. Looks like he has a tournament lance and a long sword. Sir Roland. Uh, let's see. Oh, we can find a lobby. Hold on. Do I have to find people to join me? Um, let's see. Southeast Asia, because I am in Japan, public. I guess I can't change any of this stuff, but I'll just confirm, I guess. Oh. Is this practice mode? Used. Oh, searching for players up in the top left. Cool. So this is just like a... That was cool. So kind of like in... They did put into Overwatch, you can... You have like a skirmish mode. So that's cool. Three, it uses two, the first three letters one, of your name for your information. I don't know how I feel about this, this lance. It's not as... Onto that wall on the left. Been able to get onto there. Got him, coach. Let's get him there. So this this guy right here is the one that I need to go after. I think. attack. He 
he gets that charge thing up, it's pretty much good to go. Oop! Ugh! Come on! Get over there! Get over there! Nope. So it seems to go off of... Should be good to go. Yeah, I won. Nice. Player one wins. All right. GG. So that was my first game. That was cool. And I guess let's see what happens. Almost gained a full level. Won the game. So I got a new mission right afterwards. So that has been Brawlhalla with some um, Taros and Sir Roland gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed. This has been Gost and I will see you guys later.